Lewis. Well, fired in by Ruben Diaz. And uh, Matos bore the brunt of that. It's Foden. And he's stretching and he didn't quite get there. Here's Gomez. Grealish. Just going up a notch here, City. Kovacic. Alvarez. And Foden's in there! There's the breakthrough. The holders open their FA Cup account in 2024. And after half an hour or more of stubborn Huddersfield resistance, they find their way into the lead with a lashed finish here from Phil Foden. Lewis. Tess Nunes again. Very tight, but Nunes has found a way in behind, and Alvarez stretching scores! And City double the lead. Very neat and tidy in a very tight area here, City, no question of offside at all. And Alvarez just doing enough to guide it over the line. And City, although they've not been brilliant, should be in the comfort zone now. Grealish. It's Diaz. Lewis. Bob. And inside he comes. But outside of that near post. Doing all the right things. Just can get his geometry right. Kovacic is ball and Nunes. Matthias Nunes has made a purposeful run here. And this is Bob with the Brunner arriving. It's three. May well have taken a deflection. But the game is up for Huddersfield Town. Any lingering doubts have gone. The ball over the top, perfect for the purposeful run of Matthias Nunes. And in off the unfortunate Ben Jackson. It'll go down as an own goal. Rudoni, Kovacic. And one for Thomas to chase here. Oh, and Diaz in a mess, it's Sorba Thomas! Well, that was the moment to rekindle hope for Huddersfield and Sorba Thomas could not take advantage. It's De Brenner, and Gomez and Kovacic and Foden! Beautiful goal! Well, a moment of real quality to embroider the occasion. Beautifully teed up and a perfect finish from Phil Foden for his second of the afternoon. Oh, Doku. A terrific burst from him. Hacked away by Jackson. And a touch of desperation about it. It's the Brunner shot. Quite calibrated the sights. He's certainly charging about. Foden. De Bruyne. Mateus Nunes making a run ahead of him. It's Bob. Back to De Bruyne. And in comes Doku! It's five! And the quality that have been residing on Manchester City's bench comes to the fore. De Bruyne involved at the very start of the move. And then with this lovely fullback, pullback mercilessly finished by Doku. Jackson. Here's Thomas. Well, it might run for Radulovic here. Well, great work! And Ortega denies him. Huddersfield ending on a defiant note. But sharp work from a goalkeeper who's had precious little to do. Comfortable in the end, as the holders would have expected. It's 
seeking out Walker again. It's a useful delivery and Foden's effort and put in by Bob. Well, Tottenham wanting offside. And the scrutiny in the video booth continues. It's a marginal decision. And there, the conclusive evidence. Kovacic, really carrying the fight at the moment. Rodri, Bernardo Silva. Rodri's effort, and Kovacic. And Bob with a chance! Yeah! And Petro Porro's block, he really enjoyed that. Well, some urgent defending, great desire to do it as well. There was no way through for Oscar Bob. Bob, the target here. Odin's found some space here. Here he is. The doggy round on the cover. Made life difficult for him. Odin might have appreciated this more along the ground. Gifted there to Kovacic. That's Bob's delivery. A teaser. It's Alvarez. Van de Ven got a touch here, and it is a vital block. Here's Werner. Oh, that's some good work. With well, the pass measured here for Johnson. And Ortega out swiftly, read the situation extremely well. Just going for the little dink, but couldn't quite get it. Goalkeeper. Doku. Oh, an air shot from Hoipien. But he isn't made to pay. Bernardo Silva's shot. And this is a real moment to forget for the Dane. So this goalkeeper always behind it. Oh, he's in trouble again. He's gifted it to Foden. Kevin De Bruyne. Oh, the most relieved man in North London is Pierre Emil Hoybier. Well, a horrible minute and a half, but he'll be relieved that Kevin De Bruyne couldn't take full advantage of another error. Kovacic, turned on neatly by Foden, and here's a chance for Doku. And Vicario down smartly again. Football this from Manchester City. On the border of offside there, Doku. Goalkeeper down well. Going to put pressure on the goalkeeper again. Runner's delivery. Well, Vicario's in trouble, and Ake pounces. City have broken the spell at the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Well, Vicario in all kinds of trouble, and Ake took full advantage. See the orange shirt quickly trying to engage with City, any City player who's in possession of the ball. Kanji slides it forward then towards Mateus Nunes. On the left hand side now, looks to the run of De Bruyne, who was too strong there, but Clark pulls it back and Manchester City lead and Harling scores within three minutes. Well, it's brilliant, absolutely incisive from Manchester City, and it's that man, Kevin De Bruyne, again. Providing the assist, firing it into the six-yard box, into the run of Erling Haaland, who just thumps it into the back of the net. The best possible start for the cup holders. 
going to be a massively uphill task now for Luton Town. 23rd this season, 75th in 83 games for the club. Scored three goals in four cup ties last season. Hasn't played in the competition in this, but off to a good start tonight. Well, Nunes just cuts it in behind the defender into the run of De Bruyne. And look, immediately his head's up, he's looking for Erling Haaland and he finds him brilliantly. The decisive, powerful run, the quick look and the delivery. And Haaland just sweeps it into the back of the net. De Bruyne far too strong for Jordan Clark in the build-up there, Clive. Uh, about 18 months ago now. There he is again, Alfie Doughty. And he's dispossessed Walker and he's in towards Morris. And he's steered away at the heart of the Manchester City defence. Well, that's brilliant work from Doughty. Absolutely, Jonathan, because you knew exactly what proximity they were at, whether you could turn, whether you come off of them in front of them, or whether you can spin around them. Well, he spun here, Haaland, Mengi's trying to catch him. Haaland, 2-0 Manchester City. That is brilliant. That is Erland Haaland at his best. And just watch the way. Initially, he pins and sets the ball back, but then he takes off, and who delivers it? None other than... That man, De Bruyne, strength to lay it off, takes off, drives away from the centre-half, and then sheer power with a finish. Maybe a slight defection off of Mengi and the goalkeeper, but there's two goals for Erlen Haaland. Ninth assist of the campaign for Kevin De Bruyne, and 162nd for Manchester City in his 368 games for the club. Morris is giving it away, can't do that against Manchester City, Bernardo Silva to Grealish, Holland on a hat-trick, peeling away in the middle, Jack Grealish allowed to cut inside. De Bruyne, Haaland pinning the defender to allow Stones to arrive, now he looks for the return on his hat-trick and thwarted of his third goal by Tim Crook. Good stop from the keeper, but again it just slucked such slick play from Manchester City. Wonderful goal scorers. Absolutely. Bernardo Silva looks for De Bruyne. Oh, what a goal that would have been. And the hat-trick attempt again thwarted by the goalkeeper. It's got a bit flat, Manchester City, Clive. If Luton get a goal before half-time, it'll make the tie very interesting again. But you never know, they could break out here. I thought he was offside. But here comes Haaland now. Erling Haaland chips the goalkeeper into the back of the net. Well, Tim Groves put his arm up to say that he should have been offside. Big smile on Erling Haaland's face. The most important thing is to put the ball in the back of the net and then you discuss it afterwards. He's done it three times now. Hat-trick Erling Haaland. Manchester City on the face of it, three up. And guess who provided the pass once again? It was almost as if the Vitality Stadium on Saturday against Bournemouth was a dress rehearsal. They went man for man as well. Barkley an effort from Clark well that's something to celebrate well that is a magnificent strike he's come out of nowhere Ross Barkley actually feeds the ball back to him and there is a sensational finish it really is from Clark well Barkley flicks it up he goes over Bernardo Silva said he comes back to Clark takes two touches, and then that is unstoppable. And this will be a fantastic angle to see it. Two touches, winds it outside of the post, comes back in. Until the Clark goal, Stefan Ortega had to have a shot to save. Here's Stones, so comfortable on the ball. That's the run of Nunes, it's a perfect pass. And the shot might have taken an inflection and Cruel blocked it anyway. Absolutely. That's a poor clearance away. Here he came to Bark, he does do now. Spins it into the box. Can they get another? Oh, how about this? He's rattled in another Jordan Clark. And another brilliant finish, but it's great work from Barkley, Ross Barkley. And it comes initially from a really poor Ortega clearance. Barkley has a chance to strike it. He doesn't strike it particularly cleanly, but when it comes back to him, he brilliantly lifts it into the path of Clark. We see here, there's the poor clearance. Barkley first time tries to finish. It comes back to him, control and poise, and an elegant lift into the runner, Clark, and then what a finish. 
takes it superbly. The chest control out in front of him, the chance to volley it home, and he does with a plob. Yet again for Mern, impossible position. Look. Oh, Walker, that's a lovely ball. Kevin De Bruyne, Haaland again. Haaland has four, Manchester City have four, and De Bruyne has four assists. Stones, De Bruyne and Haaland once again. Haaland. Looking for Nunez. Doku's there with it. Spinning to get the shot away. Oh, Haaland scored five. Uh, nearly a year ago, you'll remember, against Leipzig at home when they won 7-0 in the Champions League. And on a real scoring spree then. And he's looking for a fifth here tonight. And he gets it. Luton Town 2, Manchester City 5, and Haaland has scored them all. Well, the form he's in the night he's having, he's just going to take shots from almost any, any position. And being on his favoured left foot, he just thumps this with real power and it just goes through Tim Krull. Goalkeeper would be really disappointed, but Erlen Haaland is fifth of the night. He's in here again, here. Under a strike, De Bruyne. Love to see more referees in the Premier League allow that. He's a Premier League referee too. I think the referees do referee in a slightly different manner. Here's Morris, chance set up by Barkley. Decent save. Barkley's in here again. Oh, that's not too far off. Doughty with the corner. Flicked on by Barkley and kept out again by Stefan Ortega. Kanji, the role for him today. As I said, the back is Kovacic, he's quietly gone about his business. Doku, rolling inside, just pushed away by Tim Crook. Here's Stones, glides on the ball. Head up, looking for an opportunity. Slips it into Kovacic, you might have a go, should have a go, does! And they have a sit. It rocketed in. You'll be disappointed with that one, really disappointed. The Luton manager is far too easy, but brilliantly struck. It was well struck. Kovacic, who really has been quite deep most of the game for Manchester City, gets himself into a shooting position. He strikes it cleanly. I wonder if Tim Krull will feel he could have done better with it. But Stones feeds it to Kovacic. I'm not sure he might see too much of it either. Yeah, Lewis for Walker. Yeah. Oh, oh, Walker, uh, Carl uh, Walker's still there. It's, um, I think it was um, Stones. Stones who went there. Here's Townsend. Straight at the goalkeeper. Nunes has gone into a deeper role now. As he looked for Doku. That's a great run. Bernardo Silva trying to find that little bit of space and he found a little bit of luck as well. Might have been a double deflection. Well, he had too much space, did Bernardo Silva, and he was allowed just to wander into the 18-yard box. And it's a right-footed shot that takes a wicked deflection. Dubravka has absolutely no chance in that Newcastle goal. But they'll be really disappointed, Newcastle, in that they haven't engaged with him outside of the box and earlier. Because as soon as he picks it up, he has about eight yards to walk into and into the 18-yard box. You can see the line on the, eight, the, the defensive line on the 18-yard line, but look at the space he has. And then Burn backs away, they're too slow to engage, and it hits Burn on the back of the hill. And up and over Dubravka, absolutely no chance for the Newcastle keeper. He's been effective being infield rather than wide in this opening half an hour. You get the sense he's enjoying it. This is Foden. 
Sharp block. Able to get the shot away, but uh, the cannon a little kinder this time for Newcastle. Vardiol. Kovacic. We can see the space is wide down the sides of the 18-yard box. The black and white shirts trying to block it up. He's got a shot away again! Bernardo Silva! Is there another deflection? I think there might well be. The way that the Bravka dives and the ball goes on the inside of him. He's furious. Well, the old saying, if you don't buy a ticket... Certainly is applying for Bernardo Silva tonight. Oh, De Bravica was furious, and I think it's come off a of Botman this time. Just the way he throws himself away to the right, and the ball actually goes inside him. Another Bernardo Silva shot. Again, look at the space. They don't engage quickly enough, and yet just the slightest of touches off of Botman. As a left-footed strike this time is deflected inside the goalkeeper. Two own goals, Manchester City 2 0 up. Very well forward. Now Murphy. And Bird imposes himself on Isak. Big chance for Isak sweeping the left foot volley. It's a fine save from Ortega away to his left hand side. Really strong hand. It actually came about from a sloppy Ortega pass that gave Newcastle possession. Really strong left-handed save from Ortega. The two holding midfield players who would just make City tick from that position. Oh, beautiful bit of skill from Phil Foden. Well, Gimmeris does really well to track Phil Foden. Doku could be in again. And Dubraka out swiftly and sufficiently. To do. They've also been the controlling force in the game. It's Foden's delivery, looking for Haaland once more. And Diaz is there, but so is Dubravka. And Newcastle is still alive. Doku, a oh, lovely piece of play! And Dubravka there to deny him, but brilliant combination between Doku and Foden. Wonderful pass. Doku. We saw signs of this in the first few minutes. City comfortably playing their way out of the pressure situation. This is Haaland. Haaland's hungry. Oh, and we thought that was going to be another moment to treasure. Well, I just feel a third goal now would wrap this FA Cup tie up for Manchester City. Dubravka gets there. Silva keeping things moving and he'll get it back here. Murphy defending it. And Kanji got the flick. It's not away convincingly. And Guardiola having a swing. 